guys and welcome back. I am back from Las Vegas. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed some of the Vegas videos. I got one more coming up, which involves an epic prank uh, on my buddy Wes. I'm not gonna give, not gonna give you guys too much information, but uh, it was pretty epic. And he was, he was pretty stunned to say the least. So I'll post that probably Friday, but that's not why we're here today. No, sir, we are here to solve another puzzle. This week, as you saw by the intro, we're gonna be tackling another mini jigsaw puzzle. This one, however, not by Yuasaka, uh, but by Brian, hold on, Brian, Brian Young. He put together this puzzle, uh, which is apparently extremely difficult for IPP39. <laughs> Still can't say it with a straight face. Okay, IPP39 in Kanazawa, Japan. My bad, it was actually designed by George Sickerman and then exchanged by Brian Young at the IPP39. Looks about as similar as the other ones do, all the other little Yuasaka puzzles where you just gotta fit the puzzle pieces in. Obviously, there's probably a tricky solution here. So can't wait to get my hands dirty and, uh, and dig in. So guys, if you enjoy this content, really do appreciate it if you left a like, comment below, whatever you like, and uh, subscribe if you're new here. Without any further ado, let's get into solving the Martian Diamond. Oh, this is interesting. You can see the camera. You can see my overhead, so you can see me. Oh, hey, what's up, guys? Uh, so this puzzle is called the, the 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 Martian Diamond. This is by Brian Young from MrPuzzle.com in Australia. I ordered this, just saw this on his site, and I thought it was interesting. I'm really enjoying jigsaw puzzles recently, so I thought that I'd give this a shot. Here we go. So the whole point is to fit all the pieces here. Of course, you have one piece with a little alien on it. That's a little alien piece. I'm guessing that one goes here, but I'm probably wrong as there's no piece that's gonna fit there. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. So what it says here is, fit the six spaceships into the Martian diamond. You may flip the pieces over. Okay, that's it. Do they fit snug or not snug? Just randomly go about it, see what happens. So it doesn't look like they fit snug. It looks like there might be some room left. Ba -ba -ba. Okay, doesn't seem to be another piece that fits up here. Ooh, this and this go together nicely. Or not. That reflection's kind of very annoying. Yeah, I can move it over here and get it out of the, ref out of the reflection a little bit. Hold on. And nope, st <laughs> still the reflection, okay. Okay, so maybe, maybe that. Maybe. That's so bizarre. Oh. Okay. Oh, that fits. Okay, that fits. That's nice. Actually, that one is the only other one that would fit there, but I don't think anything would fit over here. Ooh. Hmm. Why? I don't understand. Well, that's kind of, uh, it's kind of symmetrical there, huh? Okay. All right. Actually, it doesn't look like it fills up the whole space, which I think makes it even more difficult. I just feel like it's more random in that case. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> this is, uh, okay. Looks good. Pretty close. Pretty close. <clears throat> oh, a star configuration. Maybe that is the secret. It's kind of a cool configuration. I'm not sure if that's uh, the way to go. Probably not, but it looks cool.
Ooh. Hmm. Well, oh well, oh well. This piece is hard to, this one's hard to fit somewhere. Ooh, I like the way that looks. Can we do this? That's kind of cool. <sighs> Trying some weird configurations out here, hopefully this does something. Uh. Okay, so what do we know about these things? We know that only this one and this one go in the corners take up the least amount of space as possible so that would make sense that they're there but also it would make sense that they wouldn't be there because that would maybe be too easy for me to figure out catch them adrift here these pieces are so big and annoying they don't fit anywhere <sighs> maybe the final shape shapes like a diamond you know like an actual diamond this puzzle's proving to be a lot harder than i thought it would I mean, I know these jigsaw puzzles get pretty hard, um, but they're always, they always seem easy just because the amount of pieces that are involved are so little. You're always thinking, ah, it can't be that hard. But uh, proven wrong, once again. This is getting frustrating. That looks like that looks like it's good. Oh, oh. Oh me, oh my. There's actually like so many orientations to like one piece. You know, there's obviously like every side of it. Then like you turn it around, it's got more sides. It just doesn't stop. Oh, that, that would have been nice. That would have been nice. That would have been nice. Mm, yes. Bam. Bam. Oh, so close. Come on. Bam. That's it. Boom, baby. 30 minutes, 
There you go. That is the Martian Diamond. Kind of strange that uh, there's like all those, you know, that's one of the things about, about these types of puzzles. Although this one was pretty difficult, I still think that these types of puzzles should be filled entirely just because there's something satisfying about jigsaw puzzles. Uh, you know, you don't do a jigsaw puzzle to, to have pieces um, in the middle that aren't filled. I just think uh, it's unsatisfying. Even though they all fit into this piece, I still think that like this looks like there could be another solution here. Uh, maybe, maybe not, I don't know. But I, f I feel if this was all full, kind of like Yuasaka's puzzle, it's just a little bit more gratifying than seeing those holes and stuff. But very cool puzzle nonetheless. There you go, the, uh, the Martian Diamond. What? Dang, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! Woo! We have solved the Martian Diamond. Took about a half an hour. I may add, as I said in the outro, uh, not so much fun for the, for the solution, uh, I have to say. Although, you know, it was tricky and it was frustrating, the solution doesn't give you a complete puzzle. It does have holes in it, which makes me believe that there might be another solution. Uh, I can't be sure on that, however, uh, you, you just don't get that satisfying, you know when that final piece fits into a jigsaw puzzle, you get this satisfying rush of endorphin. I didn't feel that here, I kind of felt underwhelmed. However, still pretty cool. I'll let the link below if you guys wanna check it out. Guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you on Friday for that epic prank. Make sure to hit the notification bell, subscribe if you're new here, and we'll see you on the next video. Peace, rah! I totally missed the camera. <laughs> okay.